friends in today's video we will see which is better to join as a fresher fang or startup yes you are right we will try to compare fang versus startup those you don't know what is fang fang stands for facebook apple amazon netflix and google so before we start let me introduce myself i am ajay dalwani and i am a founder of acharyaji now what is acharyaji acharyaji is a platform for students to make career in it and get a dream job so let's start today's topic and we will try to compare differences one by one so the first one is ownership for everything in startup you have to take ownership for everything very less people are there roles not clearly defined you have to design every piece what startup is trying to make whereas in the fang role is clearly defined and you have predefined task based processes you have to take the task based ownership and you have to take approval for every task and provide the feedback so in case of startup very few policies and no training material is available a startup is experimenting its services and products whereas in fang you have company policies well defined and training material is readily available to train yourself on the existing process in case of startup you can take few decisions by your own and try new things do some innovations wherein team can decide the best action whereas in fang you do not take any decision in case of doubt you always ask your manager your manager is your mentor in case of startup easy to crack interviews less focus on dsa dsa here is data structure and algorithm even startup will not see your degree you can work in startup while studying also founders are easily approachable on social media platforms like linkedin or twitter whereas in fang it is very difficult to uh, clear the interview dsa check is always there degree is always check any other backlog or any coding challenges aptitude test all the process is followed and it's very difficult to get the interview process in startup more focus on implementation of problem startup is trying to solve whereas in fang scale of problem is already big and predefined processes to solve the problem and document is always available in startup you have risk of losing job in case of no funding or bad idea whereas in fang has healthy customers and chances of losing job is very less unless you didn't perform well in case of startup you have low compensation and performance equity based whereas in fang you have appraisal process and yearly increment if you did well in case of startup equity offer if you if startup is doing well whereas in fang you will have good compensation and other hr policies like leaves and everything is well defined in startup more focus is given on mvp mvp stands for minimum viable product the startup is trying to build the product so they are trying to acquire customer doing improvement and innovations whereas in fang you have strict focus on integrity compliance and other company policies such as nda non disclosure agreement you have to follow all those process you cannot skip any any of those processes so friends in short it's merely employee and boss relationships work culture and other learning opportunities and future growth so it's merely depends on you what you are trying to get and what is your priorities so in short if you are working under a manager if you are learning or growing it doesn't matter where you are working merely it depends upon your life goals money priorities and future growth plan risk taking ability etc so friends this was a short video on uh, startup versus fang so do let us know in the comment box if any point is missed and do let us know also your choice which company you will join whether you will join startup or fang so this was a short video thanks for watching do like and subscribe the channel to get the latest update on the technology thanks 
see you in the next video